Hi, my name is Kirk Hamilton and this is the Sloppy Vegan Cooking Show. It's a show where we cook fast, healthy food, all plant food, to help you stay and be well in the busy world. And today's a special day, it's Super Bowl Sunday, but the real special thing is uh, we're, I'm going to a little going away a party for my niece who's got her first nursing job in Nashville, uh, Tennessee. And so she'll be leaving, so we're going to have a get-together at my brother's house later on today. And um, I'm about two and a half weeks post-surgery, so I'm a little one-handed here, but I am going to make... One of my favorite things to do is a wrap with a tofu mix, bean sprouts, noodles, and a bunch of vegetables, and hoisin sauce and garlic sauce. So I'm going to show you how to do it, and uh, then I'm going to make a few off the, off the video because it takes too long to make them all. So here's what I did. So basically I did a lot of chopping last night, and I'm, left, I'm doing it left-handed now, so I'm kind of, I'm not as fast as I used to be, so it took me some time. So the first thing is, I got some rice noodles and <clears throat> I boiled them in water and you got to look at the, the recipe but I only did it like you know four or five minutes and then I take it out and make sure it's stringy. You just got to kind of taste them and then I rinse them off with water. So I got uh, rice noodles and what I do is I cut them up so they're not really super long. So if I want to put them in something I'm not putting on a huge long string. So these are rice noodles. Then I got some just plain old bean sprouts. Um, and then my, my tofu mix, what I did was I got some regular hard firm organic tofu. I put it in a deep pot with a little bit of olive oil in it and I crumble it up with my hands. So you make it just, you know, little fine little granules. And then I start to simmer it. And then what I put in there was uh, a chopped white onion. And then I had some leftover a green a mix, you know, collards and kale and stuff like that. And I chopped it really fine uh, and threw it in there. And then I put in um, some black bean sauce. That's key. And black bean sauce is a great, um, uh, uh, sauce that you can get at any Asian store, for that matter, any any grocery store. And then I put a little hoisin sauce in there and then onion powder, garlic powder, ginger powder, my, my regulars and some parsley. And then I just mixed it all up and simmered it. So now I got, this is the filling, okay? Then I chopped up, as you can see, some parsley and carrots, organic carrots. And I want them, you know, just, just color. That's all it is. All we're doing is chopping up color. And then I got a yellow pepper and a, bell, and a red bell pepper. And then it, they will go in. Now, here's the hardest part. Chopping is a, a no-brainer. There, there's a million of these kind of wraps. If you go to an Asian grocery store, you're going to get a, a million of these kind of wraps. You have to experiment. Um, this is the brand I got. I kind of experiment with a little bit, but you got to do it each time you do it. Because the art is, the hardest part of this is wrapping these puppies and dipping them and getting them soft enough. And then wrapping it. And then having it chewable because if you do it under under um, soaked it'll come out too hard if you do and it won't roll right if you do it over soaked it's 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 tough so you just got to play with it and then the keys are hoisin sauce i was raised on it with a little boy and chili garlic sauce and then of course you got to do everything with love this is my jipa love mug where uh, my grandchildren my two beautiful grandchildren and i have organic ah Organic and black green teas that go in there. All right, so here we're ready to roll. So here's the hardest part of this whole thing. I am going to take this little rice wrap and dip it in, and I have it pretty hot, okay? And what happens is it comes out of here like, you know, like a piece of tape. Let me get rid of this. It comes out like a piece of tape that uh, sticks together all over the place. And you don't need to do it long. This is probably... My water is probably a little too hot than I normally do. Now there's probably some wonderful Asian cook that's laughing at me going, why is he doing it that way? Because it's the only way I know how. Sloppy vegan we learn on the fly. So I put it on the cutting board and try and get it as open as I can. And then I put in the hoisin sauce. Then I take a tablespoon or two of the tofu mix and then you just start lining stuff in there so a little bit of rice noodle a couple of bean sprouts love the green the parsley you could use cilantro you could lose anything you want a little green a little carrots I'm gonna put one or two strips of each of the peppers yellow and red and then these ones, I'm going to have two sets. One is going to be without the chili garlic sauce, and, and the others are going to be with it. Then you take it and you roll this puppy, 
and it's sticky. This is the hardest part. And then I tuck the ends. I tuck the ends. And I roll this puppy. And voila. That thing is going to taste good. Now I've got to make about 24 of those. So you're going to see it's going to take me a while. So I'm going to be back after I get done. And then I'm going to put one of these puppies in my mouth. But this is how you make a wrap. And it's that simple. But the key is working with the rice wrap part. That's what takes time. In fact, my name is Kirk Hamilton, the Sloppy Vegan Show, Cooking Show, and we'll be right back. Hi everyone, I'm Kirk, I'm the Sloppy Vegan, and I am back. I've been uh, wrapping salad rolls for the last probably hour and 15 minutes, and I cleaned up my kitchen. So I wanted to show you the finished results of what, we, what I put together beforehand. So I made two different batches. One has a garlic chili sauce in them, and it's this garlic chili sauce. And uh, I want to make something that didn't have, you know, heat for the other people. So I made some that don't have the garlic chili sauce in them. So otherwise, they're exactly the same. And one thing I learned, little pearl here, is these wraps. I had some old ones and then a new set. And when I was wrapping the old ones, even after I had soaked them, they would crack a little bit easier. And as soon as I used the brand new ones, open them fresh, they rolled a lot easier. So use fresh ones and toss the old ones. So, I'm going to have a bite of one. This has some garlic chili sauce in it. Now, I'm going to have a little bit of red wine, uh, Pinot Noir. And it's in my, uh, it's a funny thing, this is my daughter's baby cup. So, this is some 30 years old. And then when I have a glass of wine, I put a little bit in there because it, I don't drink very much. So, here we go. That is so good. Crunchy. A little peppery, alive, a little Pinot Noir, have what you want. So, the recipe for this is in the video description below this YouTube. My name is Kirk Hamlin, this is the Sloppy Vegan Cooking Show. Sign up for my newsletter. You have a fabulous day and eat, keep eating healthy food.